Welcome back to Adobe Dreamweaver CC. In this tutorial, we're going to continue with our project and actually add uh, navigation with uh, links. So right now, uh, in between tutorials, I added a few more little bits here. I uh, added this uh, My Plethora of Artwork, which uh, if I select it, you can see it here down here. It's a paragraph, and it has the M tag for italic. and um, the H1 tag here and this is all on the aside. I also added in the header here though after logo I added um, home 2D artwork, 3D artwork, animation reel, bio, contact. Now right now it has no formatting so I'm going to select it all go to the insert menu go down to HTML and choose uh, let's see paragraph so we're just going to make that all a paragraph unit there and then we're going to wrap that inside a navigation so down here I'm going to click on nav and it will say wrap around selection which is what I want it to do you can give it a class and ID but I'm going to do that later so I'm just going to go ahead and click OK and here you can see the nav with the paragraph tag in between now so it just it makes it really clean and all that's basically a child of the header here so the header is going to have the logo and it's going to have the navigation all right, so now in order to make this work, we need to link these to something. So, so I'm going to add links to this by just highlighting the text. So it doesn't matter if you do this in live view or design view, either one will work fine. Um, I'm going to do it in live view here. And you could even do it in code view here. But basically, I'm going to select each one. So I'm selecting home here. And down here at the bottom, I'm going to add a link. So what I'm going to type in here is index.html so basically the index page is where it'll be linked and then just hit enter and now you can see it's a linked object here it automatically adds the href which is the uh, anchor tag with the href tag which goes to index html so the next one here will be the 2d artwork and again in the properties tab down here is a great little spot for links it's very easy to add so this one I'm going to title uh, 2D uh, Artwork dot HTML. So you can kind of get what I'm getting at here. I'm just going to basically name them just like they are there. So the next one uh, I'll highlight and maybe up here in the, the live view, the 3D artwork. Click in here and then add 3D Artwork dot HTML. And then animation reel, same thing. But this time I'm going to just going to shorten this. I'm going to call this one um, animations.html. And then bio will be the next one. I'll call it um, bio.html. And then contact will be the last one contact.html now I don't actually have uh, it doesn't look like I had the whole thing uh, highlighted so let's undo just temporarily that last one you have to make sure you have the the whole text selected so uh, sometimes you just don't get it all so there we go got it all selected and we'll add contact.html so with each of these, uh, we have now our links. So we have a home, 2D artwork, 3D artwork, animation, real, bio, and contact. And you can see them all here, right? Uh, and uh, let's go ahead and format the source code just so it's a little bit cleaner. Um, we could even space these out if we wanted to. Um, sometimes I like to do that where, I don't know, it just seems like it's a little easier to see if I tab these out so I'm going to do that actually just hit return and then return and then return and return so now you can kind of see here we've got the home 2d artwork 3d artwork animations bio and contact now what's going on here is these are all linked to an HTML page and they're linked relative to what it is here because it just says .html and I would do this but if I didn't do this I, if I was in a folder someplace else then I would have to go up and down and change that structure but what I can show you 
is uh, let me grab. So here's the portfolio website here, and I have uh, the images, and then here is the index. So I have these other HTML files here, but basically this file with the additional files, which haven't been created yet, I would want the 2D artwork, 3D artwork, animations, and bio to be all in here, not in the folder images. If it was in the folder, I'd have to, I'd have to add the structure differently. Um, but basically, I'd have to go up or down the directory. But right now, they're on the line, and everything is working out just fine. Let's try that again. File, real-time preview, Google Chrome. And it looks like it popped up on my other display, but it worked. So what will happen now if I click on one of these, nothing will happen. It'll say not found. Uh, actually, the home one does work because it brings it back to home here. But all the other ones will say, you know, file not found uh, because of what it is. Now, we're going to add some additional information in the future. Uh, until next time, see you soon in Adobe Dreamweaver CC. Cheers.